Okay, this is one way I memorize gun safety rules. I either have a weapon here or I imagine one in my mind. And there's four contact points going right to left that you can imagine and you can always remember your four gun safety rules. Number one is the gun is always loaded even if you think it's empty. So what we're going to do is we're going to clear this weapon for you and we're going to assume that the gun is loaded even though it's not. Number two, finger off the trigger until you're ready to shoot. Number three, make sure the muzzle is in a safe direction. You know, don't be uh, facing that muzzle in unsafe areas. Make sure you know where that muzzle is facing, which is similar to number four, which is your backstop and what's beyond it. So all you have to remember is the bottom of the weapon or the gun contact points. Number one, number two, number three, and obviously number four isn't a contact point on the weapon, but it's out here. That's your target that you're shooting. So that's the easiest way to remember your gun safety rules. Once again, if you don't have the gun, just picture the gun in your mind. One, two, three, four. The bottom part of the gun right here the bottom of the magazine, the trigger, and here you got your muzzle. And then obviously out here, once again, is your target that you're shooting at. So let's clear this weapon here. And uh, it's safe to carry this one with the safety off because of the fact that it's a very, very long trigger pull. And the first trigger pull is double action, and then after that it's single action. So once the gun is fired the first time, then the blowback action is going to grab the next round, giving you a much lighter, crisper trigger pull where the hammer is cocked for you. And all you have to do is take up a little bit of, little bit of the trigger. The trigger will be closer in here, but we'll show that to you. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to clear this weapon. And the very first thing you want to do is... When you clear a weapon, you want to make sure your finger's off the trigger. So we're going to hold it like this with your finger indexed like that. What we're going to do is we're going to drop the magazine. Why? Because that's the source, that's the source of the ammunition and what's feeding the gun. It's the same as if you had a gas can by a fire. What do you do? You get rid of the gas can. Okay? Same thing. You get rid of the magazine. Because if there's ammunition in here, then the gun could still potentially go off for strange reasons. So put that magazine over there. Make sure you clear the magazine. Take the ammunition out if you're using snap caps because sometimes they get mixed up. Now what you want to do is you want to pull the slide to the rear. Now this one, the magazine actually catches the slide and the magazine is not in there. So we have to manually hold that slide open, look down in the chamber and we can see there's nothing in there. I'm going to flip it upside down, check the mag well, nothing in there. Put the magazine back in, decock the weapon, and you're going full safe like that. So when you fire this weapon for the first time, you're going to be carrying it like this. And what's going to happen is you're going to fire it. It's going to go back. It's going to catch another round. And then you're going to have what I was telling you before, a single action, crisp, short trigger pull to finish that off. Okay. And what you're going to do is uh, put this back on safe if you want, or if you're carrying it, you might be carrying it like that. I like carrying it like this because I feel it's safe because that first trigger pull is very, very heavy. Some might want to go like that and thumb it out when they use it and that's fine too so but anyway thank you very much for watching uh, four contact points on every handgun the bottom of the magazine here guns are always loaded treat them as if they're loaded finger off the trigger till you're ready to shoot your target muzzle awareness make sure 
you're not pointing your muzzle at anybody or anything you're not willing to destroy. And uh, number four, know of your backstop and what's beyond it. Thank you very much.